I'm sorry. Did you just shoot me? Oh my god. <laughs> Welcome everyone to Resident Evil Zero. The marketing team was brave on this one. Not a lot of games go with zero in the title. I don't know, it's it's like a, whatever. It's got a stigma attached to it, the number zero, so they usually don't go with that. But here it is. Uh, they sl they slapped that right on the title. Um, I don't know, I don't hear a lot of people talk about this game a whole lot. I guess the older games in general, not a ton of people played. I guess they were less accessible, but it was kind of kind of unique in a lot of ways. So I wanted to play it. Let's get going here. Uh, let's do normal so I don't strain myself. Still got a nice voice. I like it. Okay, yeah, everything normal here. All right. A Midwestern town in America. All right, we'll Rock go with this guy's voice. A solitary island far off in the sea, Rockford Island, an island that would become the second Raccoon City, Sheena Island. There are still many unanswered questions about these seemingly unrelated yet intensely traumatic events. Though it is believed that the International Enterprise umbrella was somehow involved, Little is known as to the origin of this faceless corporation. When was it established? By whom? And how was the T-Virus created? To uncover the truth, we must delve deeper into the events which transpired in the beginning, before the mansion incident. All right then. I mean, I think there was a there was little tidbits so offered, but yeah. what? You think so too? What? They were probably talking about the food or some shit. But yeah, so this game was called Resident Evil Zero, just because literally zero comes before one. Like the game literally takes place directly before one, like. I don't, like, the day before, or hours before, or something like that. Holy shit, okay, alright. They're not wasting any time with this opening. So weird. I don't <laughs> thought it was playing Castlevania or something for a second. Investigation of some bizarre murders in the suburbs of Raccoon City. Nothing in our training could ever have prepared us for the nightmare that ensued. We never stood a chance. What's going on? Engine failure. Emergency landing. That was pretty smooth, all things considered. Damn. Check the current position and investigate the surrounding area. Captain, look! Ugh. Captain! Hmm? What happened? Court order for transportation. Prisoner Billy Cohen, ex-lieutenant, 26 years old. Court martialed and sentenced to death July 22nd. Prisoner is to be transferred Damn. to the Regathon base for execution. Those poor soldiers. They were good men just doing their jobs. And that scum murdered them and escaped. All right, everyone. Let's separate and survey the area. Our friend is brutal and ruthless. Keep your guard up. Must be if he's 26 and already a lieutenant. I feel like that's a pretty high rank.
I know this is the part where I'm supposed to scream don't go in there, but I'm not in the movie theater right now, so I'm not going to do it. All right, the door to safety is shut. There's no turning back. Oh, I'm just right in here. Okay. All right, here we go. I, it's been a long time since I played this game. I didn't mention that. Okay, door to the dining car is locked. You can't get in. I Wasn't there a ton of people in here? I don't... It's a little bit of a ghost town. I mean, there's some bodies, I guess. The seats are stained red with blood. All right, I guess we're going this way. I should have checked my inventory. Uh -huh. This is Officer oh. Chambers from Stars Bravo team. Please identify yourself. Is someone there? The Oh boy. Okay. Oh. Uh, all right. All right. Listen, listen. We can talk about this. Ooh, two shots? Uh, I'm getting the hell out of there. I can't believe the first encounter they throw you into a sandwich. That's crazy. Okay, this was the right way. Good. <laughs> Holy shit. They don't pull any punches with this game. Like, imagine. Okay. All right. Thank you. That's not the right button what is the inventory button in this game hello okay that's the map button do I not get an inventory god this this is how long it's it's been I mean I obviously get an inventory but it might, is it not allowing me to access it right now for some reason Passenger's Diary, July 14th. Orders came from the boss today. Looks like we're in charge investigating the remains of the Arclay Mountains Laboratory. We're moving in two groups. The initial group's assigned to start checking what's left of the abandoned experiment. July 16th. Unfortunately, the test production of BOW Type Y-139 had to be suspended because of this investigation. It's the same... Uh, with type Y-139, there's still so much we don't know about responses to crustacean T-virus. There's a lot of interesting research left. Depending on the species and nurturing conditions, only minute doses of T bring about remarkable changes in solidid solidity? What? S size and multiplication of internal toxins uh, and brain development. If these effects can be controlled, a powerful weapon could be produced. Oh, okay, all right, uh-huh. Um, well, the sudden development of the shell results in a corresponding fragility. Certain areas become exceedingly weak. All right, problematically, one of these areas is the head carapace. Oh, all right. Uh, this lab is, we are going to, where they're pursuing the same research. It would certainly help to find the data and the samples that would help us in our research. Okay. Yes, I will take the handgun ammo. Okay, thank you. This poor guy must have been attacked in his sleep. His body's covered in slime. I mean, maybe better than seeing what's coming after you here. Just maybe? Okay, it doesn't seem to be anything of use. Okay, alright, hang on. Let me... Square? Square is the... Hang on, I got that right? What the hell is happening? Alright then. Holy shit. Works for me, I guess. Square? Not even triangle? The fuck? Okay, alright. Typewriter. Ink ribbon. Is there an item box in here? Oh, wait. No, I forgot. I don't think there's item boxes in this game, actually. Uh, investigation orders. Stained with blood. Um, 
I should probably specify. So one of the weird things this game does, or I should say just different, and so instead of item boxes, uh, you can drop items in this game. They actually go on the ground, so it's like a whole just different way of dealing with inventory. So it's it, it's different from the rest of the games. So anyways, uh, Stained with Blood, some sections are illegible. Eight miles north of Raccoon City in the Arclay Mountains lies our company's management training facility. It was shut down years ago. Now we are conducting a preliminary study into the reopening of the facilities. First investigation units are already on site and opening the investigation. I want your team to provide support. Following orders are... Uh... With the hand... What's investigation unit? Something? Rest is... Okay. Alright, it was getting a little bit fuzzy towards the end there. Okay, so we'll remember ink ribbon in here by the typewriter. Herb by the typewriter and all that. Since there's no item box, I'm not going to collect it and stuff it all into a item box that magically can teleport items across the continent. So we will just have to remember where items are, which memory is definitely my, my strong suit. So I don't think we have anything to worry about. Okay, he's holding something. Train key? Okay, what kind of key? Ah. Uh, hold up. Hold up. Billy. Lieutenant Cohen. So, oh. you seem to know me. Give, show him a little Maybe bit of respect to get on his good side. Me, <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> what? You were with those soldiers outside. Oh, I see. You're with stars. Well, no stars. offense. Stars. Your kind doesn't seem to want me around, so I'm afraid our little chat time is over. Wait, you're under arrest. No thanks, Dollface. I've already worn handcuffs. I could shoot, you know. Huh, why doesn't she? I guess there's bigger Edward, issues. Are you all right? What? What happened? It's worse than we Does can't. Billy not care about you this? Be careful, He's still Rebecca. walking away. Kind of a badass for that. The forest is full of zombies and monsters. Zombies and monsters. Don't be crazy. Uh. Except I did just see some. Oh. Oh, hell no. Not this early. Not this early in the game. Hang on. Nah. Nah, you, you stay down. Nope. Nope. Stay down. Okay, this one's dead. Are we good? Oh, no. Oh, no. Please. Please. N no, no, no. Hey. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Okay. Oh, shit. Okay. That was the fourth shot. Okay, we're good. Okay. Alright, we are good. Oh, wait, let's examine this. Dining car. Okay, so that's down the train all the way. Man, starting this game in a train was so smart. Edward, you're so happy just a few hours ago he's holding something. Oh, handgun ammo. Edward. But seriously, like a train car? Like, as far as claustrophobic environments go? That was really smart. Really smart design choice here. Uh, I, hi. How's it going? I, listen. Oh, your friend? Your friend too? He wants some? Okay, you guys, there's no way, like, I don't, how many shots do these guys take? Four, maybe? Are they actually down for the count? Do they take more in the original game? Oh, oh, he's getting back up, he's getting back up. I don't know if you can kind of go for headshots or, or what? 
I mean, it's going to be really hard to run around them in here, so... May as well shoot them. Wait. Is it upstairs here? Maybe I'm getting distracted, but... The hell? They look like some kind of eggs? Puddle of slime is formed around them. Okay. Um, is that it? Is that all that's going on up here? There's the herb. How many inventory slots do I get? I have six? Blah. Mixing set. Is this for mixing herbs? Okay. Um, well, if I only have six inventory slots... I don't know if I'm going to bring the herb. I mean, I guess I could bring it and then drop it in the main thoroughfare here, but... I don't know. I don't know what the main strategy is. This is Rebecca. Over. Enrico? Enrico! Wait, wasn't he in Hello? one? Can you read me? Please respond. Wow. Twenty-three people. That's a that's a lot. But he seems so cool. Enrico, Captain, hello, hello. Well, I hope he wasn't tuned into that frequency. That would be a little bit awkward. Okay, this is the dining car? Yep. Yes, please throw that out. One key takes up a sixth of my total carrying capacity. I can only hold six keys on my purse in total. It's gonna be dangerous from here on in. Why don't we cooperate? Cooperate with you? Listen, little girl, if you haven't noticed, there's some pretty freaked out things on this train. And I, for one, want to get out of here. I don't think we stand a chance doing it alone. You expect me to trust you, a wanted felon? I don't need your help. I can handle this on my own. And don't call me little girl. <laughs> All right, Miss Do-It-Yourself. What should I call you? The name is Rebecca Chambers, but that's Officer Chambers to you. Well then, Rebecca, why don't you go and try while I wait here? Alright. <laughs> wait, was well he then, just... Rebecca, he's just not gonna let me through the door? Try while I wait here. <laughs> oh my gosh, okay, alright, alright, I see you. Alright, uh, notice the su supervisors, when closing the dining car, supervisors asked to switch off the automatic doors after ensuring all staff have vacated the car, the main automatic door power switch is located on the roof of the fifth car. Inspections will take place when the train is garaged. After inspections are complete, use the ladder at the rear of the second floor of the dining car. Umbrella Corp. Maintenance Department. I'm sorry, is this train made by Umbrella? They just make trains too? Jesus. They start off as a train company? That'd be kind of funny. Okay. Uh. God damn, there's a lot of cutscenes <laughs> early on here. I don't know about this. Um, excuse me, sir. Sir. Why are you going right up to people on this train? Oh. 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 
Oh. Oh. Oh. Oh. Oh. Wait. Wait. Bring him to Billy. Bring him to Billy. Oh. Wait. Was I not supposed to do that? Oh, please don't kill me. Oh. I'm sorry. Did you just shoot me? Oh my god. <laughs> Are you okay? Yeah, thanks. You shot two of the leeches on me and it, the bullets didn't penetrate through me. I'm glad you knew that would happen. And it would kill all the rest of the leeches. Okay, also, what the hell is up with this guy? This is... Who is that guy? The fuck? That guy does not feel like he belongs in a Resident Evil game. I'm pretty sure I accidentally spliced my Resident Evil game with something else. We gotta cooperate with each other from now on. You got that? Well, I don't... Clue in, girl. Or maybe you like being worm bait. All right. But you just remember, I will shoot you if you try anything funny. Fine. Now take these with you. If you find anything, give me a call, all right? All right. What's your frequency? Because you should probably tell me that if I'm going to call you. Unless you were tuned into my frequency earlier where I found out you killed like 67 people. In which case, please don't kill me. <laughs> okay, character switching. You can control, so you can switch control between t the two lead characters, Rebecca and Billy, and use their different abilities to progress through the game. The character you currently control is the main character. The, con the character you do not control is the partner character. Controlling the partner character. The partner character generally moves independently, but you can use the right stick to control them yourself. Selecting partner on the status screen allows you to assign instructions to the character. Solo. Both characters move independently. Team. Partner follows the main character. Attack. Partner attacks nor automatically. Idle. Partner will not attack. You can also press the touchpad to switch between solo and team behavior. Okay, nice. Uh, the switching characters. Press triangle at the status screen to switch characters. You need to switch characters in order to progress in certain situations. Exchanging items. When your partner character is nearby, you can exchange items on the status screen. Yep. All right. Choose the item and exchange. Cool. Yeah. Character attributes. So what can we do? Rebecca can combine herb-related herb items. Weak defense. Can use a mixing set to combine chemicals. Billy cannot combine herb-related items because he's stupid, but has strong offense and can push many large objects because he's big and angry. All right, if partner character is attacked, both the main char main and partner characters will die if they take too much damage. You should always keep an eye on their condition. A partner being attacked in a different room will call for help over the radio. If your partner does call, go to help as quickly as possible. Cooperating with your partner. Some puzzles cannot be solved by only one character. When you're stuck, try to see if using your partner will help. This is the other main kind of thing with this game is that, yeah, you actually get to switch between using two different characters, which is pretty cool. So, all right, Billy is joined up with us. So I don't know, he's got 27 counts of homicide or some shit. I don't know, but he's teaming up with us, Rebecca Chambers. All right, and this game is in full gear now. <laughs> Let's see how this goes. All right, there's a ladder here. It seems to lead up to the roof. Climb up to the ladder. Um, I guess maybe. I don't. Uh, we were reading that document. I don't know if I should be bringing Billy with me though. I feel like maybe only one of us should be going. I don't know what we're trying to. What we're trying to do. I 
I'm guessing one of the doors are blocked somewhere. Wait, okay, what? What's... I'm guessing one of us can drop down there. What's this? Power cable's been disconnected. Reconnect the cable? Okay, is this gonna electrocute me? This... Are we good? I didn't die? Alright. Oh. Okay. Alright, so I fell in here. Alright, is Billy just chilling up on top then? So how... Oh, just press triangle? Damn, that's quick. Alright, hang on, can Billy drop? You can't reach it from up here. What, what do you mean? Can you not actually go down there? So do I gotta go back around? Wait, is... Is she trapped in here? Something stuck in the keyhole is preventing a doorknob from turning. You'd probably get it out if you had something sharp. Wait, okay, no, maybe she can get out of here? Train key? Alright, what? Roof caved in. Looks like it was destroyed by a powerful force from the outside. Herb, sure, why not? Okay, what's this? Service lift stop on the first floor. Call the service lift? I guess? Place an item here? Oh, hold on. I'm not, I'm not sure about that yet. Okay, hang on. Hang on. All right, Billy, you still, <laughs> you getting cold up here yet? It's probably a little bit chilly up there. Okay, just to make sure, I'm just gonna... Yeah, okay, that's, that's just a weird, like, way to say that you can't drop down. You know? Like, it's just... You know, I can't reach it from up here. Like, it's... it's I, I have a tough time translating that into I cannot go down the hole. But, alright. Okay, so, but I should be able to go, yeah, down the ladder. Does he have a gun? He better have a gun. I think I saw him holding a gun. Well, he had one in the cutscene. He better have a gun. Okay, good. Oh, he's got a different one. Oh, and he's got a knife. Oh, I should have gave that to Rebecca. Maybe she can use that to uh, open up that door. She said she needs something sharp. Okay, all right. So if I get to that service elevator, that dumbwaiter thing... I should be able to send the knife over to her, right? Okay. I don't, I don't, I don't trust all these corners. Oh, here we go. Okay, yep. Call the service lift. There we go, there we go. Come on. I'm assuming that's what she needs. The item's too large, oh. Okay, we need something else sharp. I guess it probably would be too large to put into a keyhole. Unless it was, had a really pointy end or something. Alright, what else do we need? Uh, access panel here needs some kind of tool to open it. Nonsense. I'm muscle man. My muscles are tools. Okay, locked from the other side. Uh, so what's the idea here? Oh, wait, 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 wait. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Okay, switch back. I really love how seamless that is, though. That it's, it's just bound to a button. Um. Like, on the controller, that there's no fucking around with, like, ten different menus, like some other games might do. Like, that, that really helps. Okay, tag reads conductor room. I don't know if that was the room that I was looking at as Billy, but I have a feeling. I have a feeling we should send that key down. Okay. Now that we've sent this elevator back and forth empty a couple times, let's actually put something into it. <laughs> okay, there we go. Press the button, send it to him. 
I don't know how we're managing this without like talking over radio at all, but they just maybe they already have a telepathic connection or something. Yeah, take it. There we go. I mean, we're already we must be at the end of the train or getting close to, so it kind of makes sense if this was the conductor's Okay. Well, it's not. Oh, wait. I think it was the other end actually. I think it actually did say that. Holy shit, they really have you bolting back and forth between the two ends of the train, huh? Well, I think I took care of all the enemies kind of on the way there, so hopefully... Alright. Very funny. You heard me talking. Are you serious? All you bastards are napping, and then all of a sudden... Fucking... God damn it. Okay, alright. Yep. All right. Anyone else want to wake up? Yep. Okay. All right. Is that one of Billy's abilities? He's like flat footed. He's fucking waking everyone up through all the train cars over here. All right. Holy shit. Okay. Maybe head over here. This should be. It's it's locked. Okay. This looks like a card reader. Oh, this is not the conductor room. Wait, that is though. Okay, all right, good. I was getting worried. I was getting worried that I was being crazy that I never saw a conductor room. Okay. Okay, green and a red, but remember Billy cannot mix herbs, apparently. Oh. Well, that's going to be quite nice. We have explored most of the train. Cool. At least the length of it. Switch here. Flip it. I... Oh. Alright, sure. What else do we got up here? Note from conductor. Key card for the driver's compartment is in my bag as always, but I need the other guy's key too to open the damn thing. Oh, Okay. But it looks like I've lost it somewhere. If it was a normal key, someone would be sure to turn it in, but this key's different. I'll look for it too, but if you happen to find it, please hand it in. Thanks in advance. Okay. Alright, looks different. Gotcha. Oh. Take a briefcase? Sure. Why not? Glad I looked in there. What the... What could we possibly have in here? Appears to be locked. There are two holes that look as if they fit some kind of round object. I will keep that in mind, I guess. Um, do I, do I take these herbs with? I don't, I can't mix them, but I could take the green just so I have healing on me. It looks like Billy also only has six inventory slots, huh? I thought he would have eight. Damn. Oh, gosh. Um, was that a warning? I don't... Was that... Was that a warning? Okay. That might have been... Okay, I haven't saved yet this playthrough, and I don't... I don't remember a whole lot about this game, so I'm gonna run down. I'm gonna grab those ink ribbons, and I'm going to save, because the save room is nearby. Okay, alright. What the hell's gonna happen? Come on. I saved. I'm ready now. What the... Okay. All right. Come on. Oh God, please. An ice pick. Okay, that's definitely what Rebecca needs. What is that nasty noise? Loot, don't mind if I do. 
Okay, first aid spray. That's what Billy needs. None of this herb mixing. Can I carry this item now? Was that what I thought it was? Hang on. Wait a minute. Uh, leave the knife? Oh, shit. This is... That is shotgun ammo. Okay, hopefully we don't need the knife. I mean, generally, you don't want to resort to melee combat, so... At least I've never figured out a good way to do it. Uh, look like some kind of eggs. Puddle slimes formed around them. Is that... Okay, is that... Is that it? Okay. Alright then. So... Is that everything? Is blue... Is... Yeah, reds are back up. Blue is Billy. Oh, and the red thing's my item. Yeah, that was a dead end. Okay. Everything's good. I got the ice pick now, though, so we're good. Oh, no. Uh-huh. All right, listen about that. How about I leave and uh, don't come back? How about that? I don't... Does that... Does that solve my problem? I don't think that's going to solve anything. Oh, shit. Oh. 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 Okay, wait. Um... I'm glad I came back in here. What is my problem today with pressing that button? All right. Uh, okay, temporarily, we're going to leave the briefcase in here. I will come back for that. You need two blocks to carry this item. Okay, since that is a big enemy, then, I guess... Okay, I'll come back for the ice pick as well. Shit. Okay, I need space. Okay, uh, Jesus. All right. Inventory management is, is just, it's just different in this game. It really is. I can't leave it here. Is there just not, oh, they probably don't want me to leave it by the door because it would be difficult to pick up. Is there too much shit laying around in this room? Is that the, is that the issue? God damn it. Kind of hide this damn thing off screen. Like, there's just a little divot in this room over here where you can, like, be where the camera changes. Okay, so... Uh, yes. That. Is it really just a... Double barrel? Ah, shit. Alright. Still probably better than a handgun. All right, come on, come on, come on. Let's do this. All right, what you want? What, what what you got? That's not what I wanted to do. I was running forward and aimed up. All right. Oh, holy. All right, open the inventory. How's my health? He's fine. The man just <laughs> took that, got thrown across the room <laughs> into the wall, and he's fine. All right. Okay, that was pretty good. That, that looks like a good shot. Ooh, all right. Listen, are you still fine after that? That looked like maybe that hurt a little bit. Oh, he's, he's, he's still fine. He's still cooking. All right, reload that. All right, get in. Oh, did that miss? Okay, reload. Combine. I don't know if I should be aiming down or just forward. Okay, I should, I should be aiming down. That's how you actually hit him. How am I? Caution? Alright, let's get the last slug into him. Okay, switch over. The handgun still, like, stuns him. Wow. 
He really does not like getting shot in the brain. Oh, if you get close, that's when he does that. Okay. Oh, back up, back up. Okay. All right. Yep, yep, creep forward a little bit. Okay, all right, I kind of got you on the ropes a little bit. Should probably reload just to make sure. Don't want to get caught with the pants down. Yeah, what are you going to do about it? You can't have much health left. They can't expect me to have a ton of ammo. Come on. Okay, that. Okay, yeah, I don't think... Shooting his armor is going to do a whole lot. Jeez. Alright. Keep that topped off. Come on. Come on. Yeah, what are you going to do? What are you going to do? Okay, he might... Okay. Alright, I got a little bit nervous. I wasn't sure if he's going to swing at me or what. Uh, so... Oh. Okay, that just came down from the roof? Sure, I'll take it. I don't think I'm going to use the first aid spray. Let's leave the shotgun on the ground because we're out of ammo for it. We know where it is. I know it feels weird leaving that on the ground, but remember, there's no item boxes. This game's just different. <laughs> All right, we'll, we'll come back for it. Okay, and then the ice pick is right here, and then I also need to grab the briefcase from this room. There's also ink ribbons in here. Which I wouldn't mind grabbing. I mean, if I really wanted to, I could run around and grab all the damn loot, but... How much effort do I want to put into it? Oh, no, don't. I need the briefcase. Right there. Okay, there we go. Okay, so that should be good. My inventory is full now. Yeah, three key items. All right. Let's do that then. All right. All right, that went that went pretty well. I don't know how many shots from the shotgun I missed. I don't I don't know how well I landed all of those, but I mean it worked. He's dead now. We're alive. Took a couple hits, a couple broken ribs, you know, shattered vertebrae, that sort of thing. You know. Skulls in a couple pieces. But you know what? I'm still walking around. We're doing okay. Uh, so. Okay, with all this, we can save Rebecca then. Oh my gosh. Open that hatch. I don't know where that's all gonna go. And I guess... I don't know what's gonna be in that briefcase. Maybe that's got the key card? Maybe that's kind of what the hint was... Uh, that note was going to. Um, I am gonna pop in here, though. Alright, I just wanted to grab a save there, and I am all out of time for this episode, so I'm gonna be ending this one here. We took out our first boss and got to see the main mechanics of this game so far, and we'll kind of see how they play out. I know there's a few more puzzles um, coming up soon. We'll kind of see the, the partner dynamic, but it definitely... I, I, I remember play, liking this game a lot when I when I played it. It's It's been at least a few years, I think, for me since I last played this one. But it definitely feels weird, um, at least in the, like, all the, like, older school titles. Uh, just with, like, being able to put items on the ground and uh, switching between, like, two different characters and stuff. It just has, like, a completely different dynamic. So, yeah, we'll get to see that, you know, through in this playthrough here. And, uh... Yeah, I feel like if you didn't like some of the other games, some of the other, like, older school Resident Evils, you might like this one. It's a little bit different. And, uh, it's, it's also nice because these two, uh, characters are kind of, are kind of fun, too. So, but yeah, that's it for this one. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.